They, I sat down with them and talked to them about my platform, and do you know what they said? We love you, Lisa, because you understand that abuse is not just about when we hit, but it's about when we use our words for harm. Did you guys know that verbal assault is a huge problem in our communities, in our schools, and in our homes? Okay? We need to be careful what we say. And if someone is saying mean things to you at home, at school, you need to talk to someone. Talk about how you're feeling and find someone to help you because people do care and you do matter, okay? But I want you guys today to promise me something. Put your hand up if you're ready to promise. I want you to just promise me one thing. It doesn't mean that you're never going to swear again. It doesn't mean that you're going to always say sweet things to everybody, your little brothers, your little sisters, your mom and dad. It simply means that you're going to start thinking before you open your mouth. Who's ready to start thinking before they open their mouth? Perfect. Because if we don't become aware, we will never change. We have to become aware of what we're doing so that we can change. Look at the hand around this little boy's throat. Is it real? No. It's not a real hand. It's a virtual hand. Inside that hand, I don't know if you can see it, but it's filled, it's filled with negative, hurtful words. Right? Things like, you idiot. You're a brat. You'll never do anything good. You're stupid. Right? But remember, people who are mean do not like themselves. So that means if mom and dad ever say anything mean to you, and moms and dads can be bullies, and we're not perfect, right? You need to make sure that you tell them, it hurts me when you call me names. It hurts me when you talk to me that way. Okay? And then what if they don't stop still? We just give up? Tell somebody. Let me tell you, you're like a superhero. Okay, I'm going to teach you this right now. When you are at home and somebody says something cruel to you, an older brother, an older sister, a younger brother or sister, I want you, like Captain America, to put up your shield. You're going to put up that shield because you are not going to own those words that people are putting on you. You reject them. Your shield is going to protect you and going to bounce those words right off you. Believe it, it will work. If you believe it, it will work. Don't let anybody make you feel bad about yourself. You are your own creation and you can create your life.